Hey guys, I wanted to jump in and do a quick intro and outro because I realized this video didn't have one. It also kind of doesn't have a resolution at all, so we'll deal with that in the outro. Um, but basically, long story short, I moved to South Dakota. So my reasonings for why I did that and um, some of what was going on at the time and uh, maybe a little bit more detail on how the move went, things like that, might follow later in another video. But this video is really scattered. Um, I do want to put a little bit of a note in here, and I'm not sure how to say this, so forgive me. I want to say that although this is a very fun experience and there was a lot of fun stuff going on, and I'm very excited, I'm very happy I moved, that all of that is positive. A lot of these clips were filmed in a really hard time of life for me, so there's a thread of there's a thread of anxiety and stress and stuff going on throughout that I'm not ready to talk about yet uh, and may never talk about on a public platform, but I don't want to go into this video and pretend everything was peachy and great uh, because there were there's so many fun things that happened in this video and I don't want to diminish those, but I also don't want to be fake and pretend like it was all a super fun process and everything was fantastic, because it wasn't. Um, the The move itself was lots of fun, um, and I'll show you clips. It's very scattered. Like I said, it was a super busy time. All of this materialized in for sure under three months from Yeah, it, from, from it being a possibility and kind of thinking through and walking through, may have been about four months, but ultimately the process and once the decision had been made to move, it took about two months between getting the process started and actually being in South Dakota, which is where I am now. I'm coming up on almost a month now. Uh, since leaving uh, home. So, oh, that's a very rambly intro, but please enjoy the various clips scattered here and there. I'm going to do my best to stitch them together somehow. They're very random and scattered, and there's some road trip footage, but there's nothing other than scenery and driving and stuff like that. So, it is what it is. Enjoy. I'll see you in the outro. Okay. I am not even sure if this video is going to come out. I don't even know what I'm going to do, um, if I'm going to even do YouTube anymore. A lot has happened since I last did a video, and I don't, I don't, I'm kind of lost with the videos right now. But I did want to go in and film today, because this day is only going to come once, and I wanted to have some footage to use if I decided. Long story short, I have been wanting to transfer out of my current university, which is a huge step for me because of my university is local. I did not move away to go to college. Um, but it, I came to the decision that I was either going to drop out of college or transfer out of state. And my reasoning for that is unnecessary at this juncture. Um, but I got an email this morning. I I picked a I picked a college that I liked in an area that I liked that's got a reasonable cost of living that I can make work. Um, that has a degree program that will work for what I want to do. And I applied there last week and there was a lot of prayer and a lot of uncertainty because it's a huge step for me. It's a huge step financially. I'm ready to be, I am ready to be independent and out and on my own mentally, but now is not the greatest timing for that for a variety of reasons that are 
that is an explanation for another video. <laughs> it is not going to fit in this one. But, and it may never be talked about. Um, but I got the email today that I got accepted to the university that I want to transfer to. And I am just on cloud nine today. So excited. It, my prayers, because I, because timing isn't good. I was really considering, you know, is this the right time to pursue this? So my prayers over the last couple weeks, um, before and after I applied were, all right, Lord, if you want me to go, you got to have the application accept clearly because I can't go if I don't get accepted. If I'm not supposed to be doing this, if now's not the right time, if I shouldn't be doing this, please stop it. Have the university reject my application so that I don't have the option. And that was my prayer. And so today, with the news that I got accepted, I am taking that as confirmation to move forward. Barring any other major barriers, I am going to be moving out of state, transferring to a different college, doing the life thing. I'm going to be moving to a state that I've never been to. I am going to be driving through like five states that I've never been to. I have never been east of the border of Nevada, the eastern border. So this is huge. I'm sad because now is not a great time to be leaving, but I'm also so happy for the next step and the fact that I get to continue my education in a place that I can afford. I wanted to film something today. It's terrible lighting. I don't even know if this is ever gonna end up in a video, but I wanted to film and capture what I'm feeling today because it's not gonna come around again. I have more exciting news. I applied for an apartment on Friday afternoon. Um, today is Tuesday. Got word this morning. Got word this morning that I am approved for the apartment. This was a, my first pick as far as it's got everything that we need, everything that we want, and then some. Um, and it's in the budget, which is just awesome. So, oh, super excited about that. So, um, yeah, another step on the road. So the big things were admission to the university and then an apartment. We have an apartment, going to be signing lease papers ASAP, been approved. So very, very exciting. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's happening. I will be moving in under two months. It's happened fast. So wrap up this semester here and get the bucket list of things done that I need to do and want to do before I leave. And then uh, I will be on my way out of state across the country. Very exciting. Lots of firsts happening. Lots and lots of firsts. Okay, update time. Pretty sure the last time I filmed anything was when we got approved for the apartment. It's been a couple months, almost. Or is it? Yeah, almost a couple months. And it is now two days before the move. So it's December 30th. I move in two days. Tomorrow is going to be some errands, seeing friends I want to see before I leave. Um, so I really have to get all of my packing finished by end of day today, if at all possible. And then probably pack into the truck on Friday night. Um, we start out on the 1st. Plan to arrive on the 3rd. And I have a lot of work to do. So that is all for now. But it's happening. It's getting so close. I'm really kind of still in a little bit of a disbelief. Um, state of mind. It's, it's happening.
happy. I will attempt updates along the way. We'll see how that goes. Uh, some days I feel like filming, others I really don't. So, um, but that is what's happening. Off on the next step of this journey. Okay, it is very early, New Year's Day, January 1st, 2022, um, about 2.15 in the morning. I am going to be leaving the house at about 5.30, so the alarm is set for 5, the truck is packed, minus the last couple of bags, um, and that is the plan sister's gonna drive with me and then fly back so that'll be fun won't be all on my own um, but I hope I'm not forgetting anything important um, got everything all squared away I think and uh, whoo it was a lot of work did the majority of the packing today so glad that it's done and leave tomorrow to go the farthest east I've ever gone by a long shot. So I am going to sit. I need to drink some water. I didn't drink any water today. I barely ate. I ate one meal. Realized at dinner time I hadn't eaten anything yet. So it was a good day though. I went and had coffee with my boss and had I uh, ran a couple errands I had to pick up a couple things still and so did a couple last minute errands and then went down to Carson and had coffee with a friend and then on the way back stopped and saw my grandparents and then came home and we had a get together at our house for uh, worship team at church so I spent the evening hanging out and stressing out because I wasn't packing and then did the majority of the packing in the last three or so hours <laughs> it is time for me to get some sleep it's a good thing I have a second driver who can take some shifts tomorrow because I am wiped it's been a very long week but exciting one though Was, that was probably like the highlight of the whole process was the road trip and I filmed so little it literally just filmed scenery um, but it was lots of fun it was also very busy so there wasn't a lot of filming going on and again other stuff life priorities things like that so um, but I haven't actually filmed <laughs> in South Dakota yet um, I'm enjoying life here I'm very excited um, I am roommates with one of my best friends in the world, and we're having a blast. The town is fantastic, oh my goodness. Although this is a video that was, you know, it was of a fun experience for me. Moving was fun, it was new, it was not how I figured I would be branching out on my own. Um, but it is what it is, it is reality. Um, But there was a lot more going on and I just, I want to explain that because whether or not you can see that in those clips, I don't want to pretend like life was great when all of this was being filmed because it wasn't. 
man, those first few clips in particular were like the worst time of my life. Um, but it's because of that that I don't want to really talk about it publicly, at least not yet. There may come a time um, if I think that, that that story could help somebody where I would want to talk about it publicly, but now is not the time. Um, I'm not ready. But I was very conflicted. It took a lot of prayer um, for me to decide that this was okay. And essentially, um, part of why I filmed the clips I did is because I wanted to see the process and I wanted to see, look back and see how God worked in each of those things. And basically what, what happened was what was a very difficult, very rushed process ended up being very smooth and taken care of. And I had peace every step of the way. Well, I hope you enjoyed that really scattered, crazy video. I'm in process of editing as I'm filming this. I'm still not sure how it's going to turn out. It's, it's a mess. But I wanted to film some of those clips. Um, for me, too, I wanted to have those clips because because of how stressful that time was, I wanted to have some footage of those milestones in order for me to go back and see kind of the joy that was part of that moment, even though at the time it didn't feel as joyful as it would have been if life circumstances had been different. Um, I don't know how else to say that other than that, but it is what it is. But hopefully this video was at least mildly interesting to you and uh, hopefully it inspires you to try something new. I don't know. I, I'm trying to come up with a point. No, there's no point. I just wanted to edit this video and watch it later myself. I don't know. <laughs> it is what it is. Um, hopefully you enjoyed it. Um, I know some of you watch this just because you like to kind of stay up with what I'm doing in life and that's perfectly fine. I tend to share more on here than I share on Facebook actually, I think. Anyway, it is what it is. Um, thanks so much for watching. I have no clue when the next video will be out. If it'll be out, I don't know. It all depends on what I want to do at any given moment. And life is starting to get busy here. So <laughs> we'll see how much gets dedicated to video time. But anyway, this was supposed to be a quick intro and quick outro, and that is not what it was. So anyway, life is good. Life is great. Uh, if there's anything specific that you're wondering about with the move that you'd like to see a video on, feel free to suggest it. I may or may not take your suggestion, um, but I might have some more kind of move related videos coming soon. Or I might just kind of show you some fun things around the town. Man, I love this town. Holy cow. Anyway, it is what it is. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Bye.